Hey, welcome back to New Super Mario Bros. Wii. In this episode, we're going to start World 7, which is Cloud World. I'm a little bit scared because Cloud World is known to be very scary in most Mario games, uh, provided they are at near the end of the game, which isn't always the case, but still, they are usually scary because they are usually platformy. But let's get started. 7-1. With 71 lives, that's funny. All right, well, here we go. How do I get up there? Got to climb behind the world. Makes a lot of sense. Oh no, moving platforms. Whatever shall I do about moving platforms? Besides playing around them, is there something down there? I can't see anything down there. Whoa! Okay, don't make a silly jump and get yourself killed. That would be a mistake. I'm going to take fire because that seems to be a better option. So let's go ahead and go with that instead. I like the idea of fire better. Uh, fire to destroy the plants. Check every pipe you see because you know what? They're everywhere and uh, any one of them could be enterable. I haven't seen any star coins yet, which is kind of making me concerned that I've missed one already. Um, see, I'm starting to worry they're like down below in the clouds there. Um, but I'm not entirely sure. Oops, don't, again, don't make a silly jump. Yeah, where are these? I'm starting to get a little concerned. Well, there's a star coin right there. How do I reach it, though? Do I have to wall jump? I got that first coin there. So it's a good thing I didn't miss anything. We are making good progress. There's the midpoint, so I will gladly take that midpoint. Shove it up my nose and then sneeze continuously. Uh, okay. We are in a new world with very wide moving platforms. I am just a little bit concerned, but that's okay. I think we'll be all right. Let me go ahead and get all those coins. Ooh, a propeller shroom. Now that I will take all day long. What? Thank you. And thank you. So thank you for allowing me to get that. Would have been quite difficult without the propeller shroom. Oh, this is getting a little wicked now. Uh, you can hit mystery boxes from any side. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is getting crazy. I'm not quite sure how to survive. I suppose we just keep up doing what we are doing. Um, I keep thinking there's gonna be uh, clouds or stars hidden in the clouds. Uh, stars, uh, coins hidden in the clouds. Um, so I'm getting uh, paranoid about it. Oh, there's the last one right there. So we don't have to worry. Or we got all of them. Check every pipe, even though the green one is probably the one we have to enter. Pop, 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 whoa! That didn't work out. That is okay. So that level went all right. Which can be expected for the first level of a world. Let's get some items. Items. Power up panels. I don't need mini shrooms, man. That's the last thing that I need. I, I also don't need those. Hell. 
That did not go well at all. I would prefer literally anything but a mini shroom. Because mini shrooms, they don't give me an extra hit. I die immediately if I get hurt. So they do not particularly help me. Oh well. Chain chomps. What's up, guy? How's it going? You're just a little cutie, that's what you are. Just a little cute little chain chomp. Oh no, floating water. This I am not a fan of. Um, water is irritating enough to deal with in this game, let alone water that floats in the air. Thank you for the power-ups. At least I can jump out of the water pretty easily. Is there something down here? Or is this just a platform that exists? Wait! <laughs> yeah! Still, we're dealing with... Uh, clouds below the screen, which... Oh, this is gonna be one of those levels where I have to release these chain chomps, isn't it? I can just tell that's what this is gonna be like, or I'm gonna have to release a chain chomp and it's gonna have to break something. How do I... Yeah! Yep, there you go. There's that right there that I have to let him make him break. There we go. Thanks, Chain Chomp. I appreciate you. I kind of figured the Chain Chomps would serve some kind of purpose rather than just being, you know, obstacles to maneuver around. Still, I will always be concerned about the clouds below the screen. Oh, there's a pipe hidden there. Um, so let's screw it up, shall we? <sighs> Getting hit in stupid ways. Losing my power-ups. Making myself vulnerable to absolutely everything. This is a very dangerous world. Is this power up? Of course it's not. That's a, that's a life that I managed to miss because I'm, again, great at video games. All right, that's a power up. I'll take that. So thanks for the hidden power up. It's better than nothing. Yeah, just fire, Bullet Bill. Fire so I can go around you. And then not pay attention and just get hurt by another guy. What? Just in case I manage to screw up a screw up a jump out of a water bubble, I can back up by uh, just spinning, which is very... Uh, very nice. Um, well, we missed a coin somewhere. Where? Because the second coin is literally two seconds before this. So where in the hell would we have missed a coin? over here. Oh, it's way over here, so you have to backtrack. Well, alright. That makes sense. You just got to think. You just got to use your noggin. Think about it a second. Like, where have you not been in the level? Well, you weren't in that particular area because the pipe pushed you past that, so you know what? It must be there.
All right, guys, that's a great place to stop. So thank you for watching today's episode. I really hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy it. I will see you guys in the next one when we continue on here through World 7. And as always, I, will, I really appreciate you guys watching. It really does mean the world to me. I will see you guys next time.